shots early, keep your heads up, and play the system. Play hard, play smart, let's do it. All right, we can't play too safe. Let's push it tonight. Come on. up the center. He brings the puck past the blue line. Sedin carries the puck into the corner. The shot to Sedin from Sedin. Theodore with a terrific skate save. It goes to the defenseman. The shot is gloved down. Theodore sends it back to the defenseman. Oh, what a chance for Colorado now. Severin with that pad save. Bob, did he ever pile drive him? Good job with the shoulder. From Sackick to Strastins. And he brings it straight up to the point. Saves it with a stick. Oland from Sabarin. Oland over to Sallow. Over to Oland from Sallow. To Sallow. From Sallow over to Naslin. Hey, hits him at center ice. Passes it to the right wing along the corner. He makes a centering pass. Sekic has the puck through the zone. It's shot over in the corner. To Leopold from Sekic. Lyles sends the puck up center ice. Naslin with the puck. Over to Sedin. That shot was stopped by the pad. The Canucks changing shifts. Fresh skaters coming out now. Oh, what a chance for Colorado now. It goes over to the right side. This is one of the hardest hits to line up in a hockey game. And from a guy that seldom hits, he's just steamrolled them right there in open ice. Oh, and here come the Canucks. Pyatt has it on the boards. Oh, and Theodore with a great stop. The shot headed bottom right. Theodore in net, ready to protect that right side of the net on the faceoff. The Canucks regain control on offense. Oh my, another shot. Hayduke plays it up to the center. Taken into the zone by Colorado. Hayduke from Sackick. The defense blocks it, and he shoots it. Boy, I'll tell you what. I thought there was an earthquake there. What an impact. And here's a chance for the Canucks. Hey Duke controls the puck in the neutral zone. The Avalanche give their forwards a rest with a shift change. And at center, breaks it up. The cry check. The puck is hit up the right side. And he brings it past the blue line. Puck back to the point. The puck doesn't get to the intended receiver. Oh, he got a pretty good lick in here on open ice, folks. Not the best hit he's ever delivered, but it sure did the job. Brunette does a great job picking off that pass up. Knocks that shot away with a goal stick. It's shot back. Severin makes that poke check, protecting his goal. Sit to the left wing. 
Turgeon controlling the puck in the corner. Up the left side. Morrison, center ice. Morrison gets checked in the corner. From Brisebois over to La Perriere. Turgeon gets drilled at center ice. The Canucks changing shifts with their forwards. Scrastinch sends the puck on, but no one's there. And the Canucks get it for the icing call. The linesman will drop the puck left of the net. The Avs will try to bring it up now. Sends it to the defenseman. To the right wing in the neutral zone. Turgeon sends it to his defenseman. Oh, and here come the Canucks. He makes the blocker save. To Brunette from Turgeon. And they're attacking, looking for a chance. It's shot. And it was stopped by that right pad. Kessler at center ice. It's sent back to the point. Behind the net. Clark with the pass up the center. Was that me or did the building shake on that hit? We don't expect it from him, but that guy really stoned him. In the defensive zone. It's set up the left side. And he shoots. From Sabarin to Sallow. From Sallow. Over to Kessler. Turgeon checks him hard at center ice. Controlling it in the corner. Cook body checks him to the ice he goes. And he's got it through the zone. To Turgeon. He's got it in the corner. Over to the right wing. Brings it up through the zone. Oh, and there they go, the Canucks on. Oh, and Theodore stops it, coming from the right side. From Kessler. Lyles in now his shift in as they get fresh forwards out there. Passes over to the left wing. Ripped. Severin stops it, going low left side. Nothing doing there. Has it at the point. He's all tied up. Fires it hard around the boards. Passes it to the right wing. Oh, and there they go. The Canucks on the move. Theodore with a stop. He blocked off the left side there. From La Perriere to Lyles. Terja from Leopold. In a shot. Severin makes a save using that blocker. And now Vancouver with it across the line. Sedin checked in front of the bench. Oh, and Theodore with a pad save. Stops that one-timer. The Perrier passes the puck to the center. The Avalanche bring up the scoring line. Over to Mitchell. Sedin checked at center ice. Luxonen roughing it up at center ice. He feeds it up the left side. He's got it over the blue line. Oh, and here come the Canucks. Sedin around back of the net. He's got it along the boards. He, he scores! They get out in front first here on the road. Talk about some boomerang action here, Bob. The last goal was a one-timer that went off the left post. The goalie had no hope. Theodore, he really nailed that one-timer, Harry. The goalie, whatever chance he did have of stopping that one, ended as soon as the shot hit the iron. Yep, just hit the pipe right to get it to ricochet in. That was a great shot. And don't forget the setup, man, Harry. Another face-off about to commence on, here guys. shortly. Let's get and the face-off is won by Vancouver. And Colorado has the puck defensive zone. Svatos passes it up the center. Breezebois over to Sakic. He passes it up the right side. And here come the Canucks. Green with the puck. And Colorado has the puck defensive zone. Hadou in the neutral zone. It's ripped. Bob, look at the location of the right pad. 
It was right there to stop this wrist shot. It's fed back to the point. He's got it down low. Brisebois is held against the boards. Theodore with a beautiful poke check. He passes to the defenseman. Oh, and a chance for Colorado now. Severin, smart play to just hold on. Yes, they're rocking. They're taking the roof off, having a great time. That's what this crowd is doing right now. Yeah, you talk about momentum. This is sometimes how it starts. The Avalanche with possession after that faceoff. They're dead. <laughs> The Abs have come right back and tied this one up with that goal. And there's a lot of hockey left to play. We've got a fresh game here in the first period. The puck now to the right wing. Now Vancouver into the zone. He shoots. Vanenen hits the puck up to center. It goes to the point. To Morrison. From Morrison over to Olin. Now the puck up center ice. Oh, and a chance for Vancouver now. Up the left side. Sallow to Pyatt. And Theodore stops the play with a poke check in net. Any more stick there, and he's likely going to be called for hooking. Knocks that shot away with a goal stick. He passes it up that right side. And he has it at center ice. It's passed to the point. Oh, and a chance for Colorado now. Pass the blue line. Luxonen with the puck along the boards. They get it away. To the right wing. Bielus at center. Along the boards with the Theodore with the stick save. The puck's out there in the middle. To the middle. And Theodore again stops the shot. Leopold fires out the pass, but that's up for grabs. Here it is, Colorado on the move. Watch this one, Bob. Some nice work here on the part of the goalie. He had this one figured out from the beginning. Look at the way he moves right into place to cut off the angle. And a nice stop with that big blocker there to complete the save. The players get set to face off. Bob, I'll tell you this from experience. If your butt is dragging on the bench, this is music to your ears. Listen to that chant from the home team in a game that's tied up. And a lot of times, fans are just tentative at this point, but not tonight. The Avalanche are able to get it back. Sabarin with a shorthanded save. He passes to the defenseman. From Mitchell to Kessler. Now Vancouver into the zone. From the corner. And in the neutral zone. Over to the left wing. Oh, what a chance for Colorado now. The puck has hit up the boards on the left side. And now Vancouver is able to clear it out. The Canucks are able to switch out their penalty killing line. Svatos skating with it at center. It goes to the point. He's in the corner. Hey Duke to Brisebois. He's got it along the boards. Passes it to the right wing. At the point, the puck is centered. Salo clears the puck for his penalty killing unit. Svatos from Scrastinch. He feeds the puck to the left wing. Theodore will get called for being offside. They're ready in that big circle. Colorado wins the draw. Brunette has possession along the board. It's tipped towards the net, but he makes that stop. Tipped and a save. He has it along the boards. 
to La Perriere. From La Perriere, Colorado picks it up. The shot is blocked. And now Vancouver is able to clear it out. Puck over to the right wing. Up through the zone. To Brunette from La Perriere. Oh, and Salo with a nice poke check there. Passes over to the left wing. Severin makes the save and the penalty continues. Turgeon manages to get it out. The puck gets set up the right side. And now Colorado with it across the blue line. Fired! Oh, and Sal hits the puck up to center. The Avalanche changing shifts for their forwards. Over to Stastny. He carries it over the blue line. Behind the net. Puck back to the point. They stop the shot. He passes it up the center. Cook skating with it along the boards. And he successfully covers the puck. Clark dishes the puck center ice. From Clark to Olski. Severin with a pad save. Fitzpatrick sends it to his defenseman. It goes to the defenseman. Kessler brings the puck up. Shot. Excellent defense to block the shot. Cook controlling the puck. McCormick from Vennanen. McCormick has it at center ice. Back to the point. Over to Stastny from Clark. Has it in the slot to Vennanen. He can't pick up the puck from Vennanen. He's covered and feeds it out of the corner. From Mitchell over to Cook. This is a great example of execution on the takeout. Not a big hit, but a very effective check. The Canucks switch up their offensive line. The puck has hit up the boards on the left side. Bulis over to Pyatt. Oh, and a chance for Vancouver now. Shot. Theodore stops it. He got the block already. Gets it over to the left wing. McCormick sends the puck up center ice. The puck is centered. Stops it with a pad. And it's controlled at center. Quick poke check to break up the play by Lyles. To the point. He's got it along the boards. Stastny feeds it out of the corner. The Avs make the D-line change. To Morrison. There it is, Vancouver. Um, he stops him, shuts him down on that breakaway. Scrastinch holding him along the boards. The puck is hit up the right side. Then taken across the blue line by the Avalanche. Out of the corner. Waltzki. He scores. shot away and only a second he needed Harry great positioning to pick out a spot although with one timers there isn't a lot of picking out to do no nope, you really just have to fire I've heard a lot of great shooters say you know when I shoot the one timer I either go high or low and that's about it not a bad methodology whatever he used on this one it worked and we've got the face off coming up And Vancouver wins the draw. The puck now goes center. He has it along the board. Frycheck with the puck at center ice. And now the Abs win it in their own zone. He's controlling the puck at center ice. Rycroft goes behind the net. Arneson getting held up along the board. Nasland puts the puck out center. Past the blue line. Fires. He gets the rebound. Theodore. And the stop. Puck over to the right wing. It's sent up the left side. Sent back to the point. Over to Sedin. 
through the zone. Arneson steals away that right side pass. Sedin passes to the defenseman. From Salo to Naslund. Loxinen breaks it up with the poke check. Arneson from Loxinen over to Loxinen from Arneson. Controlling it in the corner. The point blank shot. Maybe too close. Sometimes all you can see is the goalie. You can't see any of the net. A good pad save. He feeds it up the left side. Arneson through the zone. Over to the point. In, down, low. Severin makes the stop. Down one goal, holding his part on the defensive bargain to stay in this one. Sends it to the defenseman. He passes it to the right wing. Oh, what a chance for Colorado now. Locks it in with the puck in the neutral zone. There they go, the abs on the move. Oland hits the puck out center. Now Vancouver into the zone. Over to the point. Theodore makes the save. His team's in a one-goal lead right now. Loxinen with the puck in the corner. From Vanninen over to Clark. He passes it to the left wing. Loxinen over to... He scores! like it came from behind the plane of the goal line. I can't believe it, Bob. What an amazing shot. Only the best shooters can pull off a play like that, Harry. What an eye, and what a feel for pinpointing a target. Position to start up the action. The face off won by the Avs. To the left wing. He brings it past the blue line. Hey Duke behind the net with the puck. Lexa passes the puck to the center. Taken into the zone by Vancouver. Over in the corner. Mitchell with the puck. He centers it. Hey, Duke has it. Center ice. The shot. Severin stops it. He was aiming bottom left, but no room. Back to the point. It hits his own man. And Theodore holding down the fort. They've got a two-goal lead. It goes over to the right side. He Severin with that pad save. Passes the puck to the center. Over to Bulis. He controls the puck along the boards. He makes a centering pass. Controlled at center ice. The puck to the left wing. Fired. A blocker save. Sabarin relays the puck back to the defenseman. Two men back and the goalie. From Pyatt. And Theodore stops it. A great glove stop. Morrison with beautiful use of that hockey stick. Theodore with a fantastic glove save to stop that one-timer. Hey Duke from Scrastinch. He passes it to the left wing. Svatos controlling the puck in the corner. Sabarin covers it up. He just doesn't want to take any chances. Listen to these fans. They're cheering their team on. It's not like two is enough. They want to make sure these guys stay sharp. Harry, they want that one more to put it away. Two minutes left in the period. Kessler has the puck through the zone. Down under two minutes now. The puck carried. Puck back to the point. The puck goes to the defenseman. To Salo, from Salo, to the middle. Lyles passes it up the center. Saves it with a stick. Salo over to Kessler. And now Vancouver with it across the line. The cook from Kessler. And the delayed penalty will be called. 
stops that one. He committed on the shooter, but made that great blocker save. A minute 18 more to go. Across the blue line, gets it over to the left wing. He decides to center the puck. Interference is the ball. Moto. The faceoff is on the right side of the goalie. Vancouver wins the draw. And along the boards with the puck. Only 55 on the game clock. Sedin freezes him against the glass. The puck tipped away. To the point. Theodore makes the big shorthanded save. And now the Avalanche clear it out, trying to kill the penalty. He feeds it up the right side. Nasland at center. Two on two, here we go. He passes to the right side. The neutral zone, 18 seconds on the clock. He brings the puck up, and they're getting away. It's two on two. He shoots. Oh, and Theodore keeps his team alive with a great save on the penalty kill. The faceoff taken by Colorado in their own zone. And they clear the puck. Less than a minute left in the penalty. And now Vancouver in their own zone. That's the end of the period. And the score after one is 3-1. It's time now for the Dodge Intermission Report and Highlight Reel. A little montage of the moments here in that first period. Here's a game where the advantage is really in the intangible. You can't really look at the numbers in this game and say it's a one-sided battle from either team's perspective. This is one of those games where you watch and wait and see who comes up with the big play or who can capitalize on the other team's mistakes. The Avalanche don't have a lot to change in this game as we get going here in the second. I think the coach knows they can hang on to this lead with some solid defensive play. And the faceoff is won by Colorado. Passes it to the right wing. Svatos gets checked at center ice. Here come the Canucks for the chance. It's passed to the point. Sallow through the zone with the puck. From Sallow to Olin. The puck played up center. It's shot. Deflected off the defense. Theodore delivers the puck back to his defenseman. Brisebois from Svatos. Over to Svatos from Brisebois. And here come the Canucks. He's got it in the corner. He passes it up the right side. He's got it over the blue line. It goes to the point. Oland has it along the boards to the right wing. Nasland knocks the puck to the center. The penalty is over. We've got both teams now at even strength. Hey Duke with it and here's a two on two opportunity. He passes to the defenseman. Passes over to the left wing. To Lyles. From Leopold over to LaPerriere. Shoots. And it was stopped off that left pad. Mitchell to Morrison. Now the Avalanche right back in. Over to Mitchell. He sends it up the center. And the defense has to get back there. It's blocked. He had a dive to the ice to stop that shot. Wow. It's fed back to the point. Brunette is in the corner. 
Severin covers up the puck, playing it safe. And this face-off will be to the goalie's left. And Vancouver wins the draw in their zone. From Krychak to Fitzpatrick, has the puck in the neutral zone. Puck back to the point. Arneson out in the middle. Clark with a deke, then taken across the blue line by the Avalanche. Saberin stops the play with that poke check. He's with the puck at center ice. Rycroft plays it up to the center. Poke checked away by Luxonen. The puck is centered. Shot again. Theodore, nice save. He's not letting them back in this one. They've got a two-goal lead. Here's the odd man, three on two. Controls it in deep. It's passed to the point. Controlling it at center ice. Rycroft hits him at center ice. He carries it over the blue line. To Cook. And it's a two-on-two. Two. They have it at center ice. Here's the rush. Two-on-two. Two. The puck is in the corner. Kessler in the corner. Kessler able to send the puck out. And they've got it in their defensive zone. Controlled by Salo. Olin makes the pass to the defenseman. He brings the puck through the zone. Along the corner boards. Scrastinch dishes the puck center ice. Rycroft brings it up through the zone. Here come the abs with a chance. The pass isn't any good. It goes over to the right side. Cook holds the puck in the corner. The puck sent to the defenseman. Lyles and his offensive line coming now as they get some fresh skaters out there, changing out their forwards. From Sabarin to Nasland. And now Vancouver with it across the line. The corner. Theodore over to Leopold. He passes it to the right wing. Over to Nasland. Controlling it in the corner. Leopold forces the loose puck with a poke check. From Arneson to Rycroft. He controls the puck along the boards. To the left wing. What a stick save. And it was something to behold off the one-timer. Hardly any time to react on that shot. And here's the three-on-two rush. Naslin in deep with the puck. Mitchell with a puck in the defensive zone. It goes over to the right wing. Up the left side. He brings the puck past the blue line. He passes it to the left wing. Sedin with the puck along the boards. From Sedin, the defense blocks the shot. Loxanen puts the puck out center. The avalanche chain shifts. Fresh skaters coming out there. Over to Sedin from Salo. And he scores! His team now within one goal of tying this game. When you've got your playmaker sitting out there at the point and he feeds the puck like that, wow, what a deadly combination to set up the one-timer. No kidding, Harry. He had a great view of the offensive ice, found the guy open he wanted, and boy, did he get it there in a hurry. Yes, just the right speed, weight, beautiful feed. Give this guy credit for an A-plus assist. It's time to get this game going again. Here's the drop of the puck. The Canucks with the puck off the faceoff. They're down one goal. Now Colorado's got it. Puck over to the right wing. Oh, and here come the Avalanche. Severin makes the stop, keeping the deficit at just one. Brisebois with the puck at the point up the left side. Pyatt holding the puck in the neutral zone. Oh, and here come the Canucks. Smatos makes the pass to the defenseman. He's holding the puck in the neutral zone. 
He makes a centering pass. The goal stick to the rescue. Knocks that away. From Bulis over to Morrison. And he brings it up. It's shot. Theodore holds on for the save and keeps the one goal lead. To Sakic from Leopold. He feeds it up center. And now Colorado with it across the blue line. It's fed back to the point. Morrison brings the puck up. That shot was stopped by the pad. Lyles with the pass up the center. Bob, no shortage of thanks and praise from these fans. They're loving their goaltending tonight. Goaltenders know the other sound is they really appreciate it after they've had a night like this. The puck gets set up the right side. The Canucks are going to get some fresh skaters out there changing out their forwards. He passes to the defenseman. Mitchell over to Schwinar. Skating along the boards, he has... Theodore makes a nice pad save. You know what tests the goalie's quickness more than anything else is surprise. A D-man coughs up the puck in front of the net, and this guy with his quickness makes the save. Theodore protecting the left side of the net. And here's Vancouver off the draw, past the blue line. Over to Salo. Vancouver back into the zone. The puck hits a player and then bounces off the glass. Was that my imagination, or did the building shake on that one, Bob? What a crunch. Vanninen sends it up to the center. From Vanninen to LaPierre. Taken into the zone by Colorado. Hits off the defenseman. Schwinar from Olin. There it is, Vancouver on the rush. Along the corner. Wow, that hard shot was deflected down in the corner. This is a huge shot block. When you're up by one, the goalie never even had to think about making a stop. He feeds the puck to the left side. Brunette holding the puck in the corner. It stopped, the shot deflects off the goalie. The whistle blows for offside. The skater's ready now for the official to drop the puck. The face-off won by the Avs. The puck now to the right wing. Wow, open ice and some serious force behind that one, Bob. He's a tough customer. Here come the Avs with a chance. It's sent back to the point. Scrastinch sends the pass, but no one can get to that. Back behind the net. McCormick is checked in the corner by Mitchell. Over to the left wing. Sedin leading the attack two on two. He rips it. Wolski plays it up to the center. To Stasny. Pressured. It's passed out of the corner. And out in front. And all oh, the puck hits a post. They're down by a goal. Trying to tie this one up. And he gets denied by the post. When you've got your playmaker sitting out there at the point and he feeds the puck like that. He stopped him. He just stoned him on the breakaway. He feeds it up. The right wing boards. Nice defense at center. Tipping the puck away. And he shoots. Stasny takes it behind the net. To the middle. And it was stopped off that left pad. There it is. Vancouver on the rush. And now Vancouver with it across the line. Denied a terrific stop to shut down that man on the breakaway. Over in the corner. Sedin hit hard in the corner. Man, are we talking high impact hockey here. A super shoulder hit into the corner, Bob. Oh, and here come the avalanche. The shot. Severin with a great stop. The shot headed bottom right. He passes it up that right side. Oh, and there they go. The Canucks on the move. And they clear the puck now. Severin comes in as his team chain ships. This guy has amazing speed. And if you're not on top of your game defensively, you can forget about it. He's long gone. Here we go. The face-off to the right of the goalkeeper. The face-off taken by Colorado in their own zone. From Lyles over to Brunette. And all the abs have a chance here. Oh, baby, he shut him down on that breakaway. It's set up the left side. 
Morrison holding the puck at center ice. There it is, Vancouver on the rush. Theodore, glove save, and he made it look easy. The puck is hit up the right side. Bielus in the slot. The defense blocks the shot. In the neutral zone, it's passed to the point. Shooting! Has it behind the net. Brunek passes out of the corner. Sabarin with a terrific save. His team looking to get this one tied. Pyatt holding the puck in the neutral zone. Shoots it. Theodore makes that beautiful save to preserve this one goal lead. Clark over to LaPerriere. Pyatt sends it up to the center. Over to LaPerriere. And he takes it through the zone. Sabarin kills the play with a poke check. He passes to the defenseman with the puck at center ice. Here come the Canucks with a chance. From Morrison, that shot off the left pad. Mitchell from Pyatt passes it to the right wing. Theodore stops it. He was aiming bottom left, but no room. He passes it up that right side. Oh, and they move it out quickly. Here we go. Taken into the zone by Colorado. And a superb defensive play, poke checking it away. Mitchell plays it up to the center. The Canucks get the chance to switch lines. They wanted to swap D lines. They're ready now for the puck drop. The Avalanche get the face off, leading by one at home. In the defensive zone now, Svatos sends it to his defenseman. It's Sabarin with a pad save. Hook check. Colorado is able to grab it. Sedin sends the puck up center ice over the blue line. Theodore stops it. He was ready with a stick. Over to Leopold from Svatos to Lyles. It's poke checked away. From Krychek over to Kessler. Gets it over to the left wing. The puck gets set up the right side. To Leopold from Sakic. The puck gets sent to the center. Hayduke holding that puck in the corner. Krychek over to Sedin. Carried into the corner. Broken up by Hayduke. Over to Sakic. And here come the Avs. From Sakic to Svatos. Over to the left wing. Hayduke behind the goalie. Sabarin decides to hold on. Not wanting to take any chances. Down by one goal. Here's Colorado with it. Sent back to the point. He scores! out to make the catch but it just didn't happen and the puck sneaks in Bob he thought he had that one you can see it in his eyes just before they became huge with the realization he didn't actually make the catch and the result a goal here's the face off coming up The Canucks get the face off. They're down by two on the road. It's fed back to the point. Around back. Sent to the left wing. Makes the stick save. He kept his eye on the shooter. Beautiful stop. And here come the abs. Sabarin makes the nice pad save. Over to Sallow from Sabarin. Schwinard with the puck in the corner. Behind the net with the puck. Theodore stops that shot. The two-goal advantage here, still alive. Clark sends it up to the center. You gotta like the way this guy plays. He doesn't take too many risks. He just lines up his opponent and whops him. 
Green has got the puck to the point. Schwiner, great defensive work to break up the play. Carried it into the corner. Oh, and here they go. Whitecroft started this fight, but I think the reason for the fight started earlier in the game. There's been some contact and some words exchanged out there on the ice. You bet, Bob. You can just feel it sometimes. Big time payback. Whitecroft wins the fight. He started it. He came away with a victory on the ice. I guess he knew what he was doing. And Bob, this team is already injured on the scoreboard. The faceoff taken by the Avalanche. Scrastinch brings the puck up through the zone. It's shot. That shot off the left pad. He plays it up to the center. Taken into the zone by Vancouver. And a pad save by Theodore. From Breezeball over to Hayduke. Sakic has control and it's going to be two on two. Sent to the left wing. Sedin with a puck at center. Over to the... Oh, and Theodore stops the wrister. It was pad. The puck goes to the defenseman. They deflect the shot. Brisebois passes to the defenseman. He sends it up the center. And he brings it past the blue line. Bielus in the corner. To Svatos from Scrastinch over to Hayduke. Here come the Canucks with a chance. Hayduke pokes it away. Passes over to the left wing. Sabarin in now. His team changing shifts for their forwards. This guy is a hard guy to play against, even if he's having a little trouble on the ice. You know he can have a positive effect on his team once he gets in the locker room. He's a real top-notch team leader. Here comes the face-off to start the action again. The Avalanche win the faceoff in the lead, up by two goals here at home. Leopold over to Lyles. Terja gets hit at center ice. Shoots again. It's broken up. The puck is hit up the right side. From Morrison to Pyatt, the Canucks get whistled offside. The officials got the puck in hand, and he's ready to start things up again. The Avs will try to bring it up now. Brunette holds the puck at center ice. He feeds the puck to the left wing. And it's stopped. No luck getting it by. Down low. And Colorado is able to get it back. Over to Turgeon from Leopold. There they go. The abs on the move. It's sent to the right wing. Cook with the pass up the center. And they get the puck ahead trying to get a chance here. He's got it in the corner. Lyles playing physical in the corner. To Lyles. From Theodore over to Leopold. Kessler has the puck in the corner. Poke check. It's passed to the point. He's got the puck at the point. He feeds it up the left side. Lyles pokes it away. Wonderful play. Along the corner boards. Kessler gets hit. It's a goal. They have now brought themselves to within one goal of tying this game up. With that goal coming late in this second period. Forget the goal. How about this pass? Well, he flipped it over to his man on target. And the shooter did the rest. I'll tell you, Bob, he could not have flipped it any better if he was making those hot pancakes. Illuminating as always, my friend. The skaters look ready in that big circle. And Vancouver wins the goal. The puck is hit up the left side. Taken across the blue line by the Canucks. To Olin from Schwinar. Over to Salo. From Salo to Linden at the point. Olin, his pass into the corner. Schwinar goes back behind that net. Theodore kills the play with a poke check. 
He controls the puck in the neutral zone. Svatos has the puck in the corner. The puck is centered, and it deflects off the glass. At the point, the puck controlled by Svatos. Linden plays it up to the center. Sedin has it at center ice. He's got it through the zone. Sabarin makes the save. His team down a goal right now. Doesn't want to give up another. Hook check by Schwinar. Sedin over to Mitchell. And with the puck at center ice. Oh, and there they go. The Canucks on the move. The puck is in the far corner. Over to the point. Sends it to the defenseman. He shoots. Theodore makes the save. He sure doesn't want to give up this one goal lead. Linden, good play to break it up. Schwinar is in the corner. Hayduk sends it back to the defenseman. Linden passes the puck to the center. The Canucks changing shifts for their forwards. The puck gets set up the right side. Svatos takes it up through the zone. He shoots. Morrison has a penalty coming up for him. Here's a good time to check out the interference call, Bob. Harry, he was clearly trying to get away with some extracurricular activity there. <laughs> no doubt about that, and he's going to serve some time in the box to think about it. The goalie will be preparing the left side of the net here for this faceoff. Colorado wins the draw. Just a minute 29 left in this game. It goes to the point. Has it at the point. Now Colorado setting up the power play. There they go, the abs on the move. Leopold, the puck to the left wing. Sabarin makes the... Sabarin braces for the faceoff near his goal. The Canucks win the draw. They are still at a disadvantage and will use the penalty killing line here. The puck goes to the defenseman. 58 on the clock. Over to the right wing. Passes over to the left. Sabarin makes the save. They're still short-handed. Colorado regains possession. Sabarin makes the save. They're still short-handed. The puck comes out of the corner. Leopold has the puck sent back to the point. And now the puck is controlled by Lyles. The pass is missed from Lyles. Turgeon checks him in the neutral zone. There are 23 seconds left. Sedin makes the pass to the defenseman. Lapierre with the puck at center. Salo poke checks from Sedin over to Sedin. He brings it past the blue line. It's sent up the left side. Turgeon has it at center ice. Puck back to the point. And
taken by Vancouver. He feeds it up the left side. And Vancouver has it at center. To the point. The corner. The sell from Sedin. He passes to the defenseman. Now Colorado's got it. He's got it in the neutral zone. Over to the left wing. Pedro with it, and here's a three-on-two opportunity. He centers it. Sedin in the neutral zone. Over to Sedin from Sid And Theodore stops the shot, and he doesn't want to let go of that one-goal lead. Salo in the defensive zone. The puck is hit up the left side. He's got it through the zone. Hey Duke with the puck in the corner. He centers it. Severin, his team down by one, makes the smart call and covers the puck. The Abs win the draw. They have the one goal lead here at home. To the left wing. Terja snags that left side pass. Hyatt leading the odd man rush, three on two. Lyles puts the puck out center. Brunette with it now, two on two. Severin makes the stop, keeping the deficit at just one. And it's control, center ice. Oh, and here come the Canucks. The play gets broken up with a swift poke check. Lapierre through the zone with the puck. There they go, the abs on. Severin stops it. He was able to kick it out. The Canucks send the puck up ice, clearing it out. And now Colorado into the zone. Behind. Severin stops that one. It was going low right. Salo knocks the puck to the center. And they're getting there now, two on two. In the corner. Nick. Tie game here in the third. Teams ready for the drop of the puck. The Canucks get what they wanted on that play. Third period hockey. They get the tying goal. And they've got the momentum they want and a clean slate. Salo passes back to the defenseman. The shot. Scrastinch controls the puck on defense. Here come the Abs with a chance. He's got it over the blue line. Arneson has it in the corner. Arneson hit hard in the corner. Two men back and the goalie. Naslin carries the puck near the boards. Over to Arneson from Loxanen. And he shoots. Wycroft has it down low. Sent to the left wing. Knocks that shot away with a goal stick. He passes to the defenseman. Has it on the boards. He shoots it. What a poke check to break up the play. To Naslund. Oh, and a chance for Vancouver now. In the corner. Back to the point. Oh, and a chance for Colorado now. Luxonen with the puck at center ice. He shoots. Sabarin with a stick save. From Sabarin over to Krychek. He feeds it up the right wing boards. And they're getting there now, two on two. He feeds the puck to the left side. Sedin delivers that nice check. If you're a good playmaker like this guy is, you have to mix it up. You have to shoot sometimes. Then you can set up your plays. If you're strictly a playmaker, the defenders know that, and they'll take away the options. Both teams looking to get a goal here in the third to pull ahead. The Avs will try to bring it up now. The Screstins from Sakic over to Sakic. Here it is, Colorado on the move. Fires. Salo sends the puck up center ice. And here come the Canucks. Behind the goalie. And now Colorado in there. Theodore with a beautiful save. Bob, he's flatter than a bad singer now. And we've got the faceoff coming up. The score is tied here in the third period. Here's Vancouver with it. Oland with the pass up the center. It's controlled by Sedin. 
He carries it over the blue line. It's fed back to the point. From Scrastinch, Sedin from Nasland. It's shot, and now the Avs win it in their own zone. He passes to the right side. Svatos with the puck in the corner. Olin sends it back to the defenseman. Nasland at center. Hook check that center ice. The puck sent to the defenseman. Sedin is against the boards. Lyles over to Sakic. The neutral zone. It's fed back to the point. To the right wing. Nasland has it at center ice. Gets the puck away with that poke check. Oh, and Theodore able to grab it with the glove. Lyles passes the puck to the center, then taken across the blue line by the Avalanche. He's in the corner. He scores! A third three and goal to put the match on. still poked it in on the right side on that wraparound. Gorgeous wraparound there, Harry. The goaltender just wasn't positioned properly. No, he wasn't, and it was a great job by the shooter to recognize that fact and capitalize. The Avalanche now lead the game, and what a time to be ahead. We're in the third period, and it's a one-goal game right now. And along the boards, Brunette. Leading the attack here, it's two on two. Across the blue line. Over to Turgeon from Brunette. To Mitchell. And all the puck is off the post. Sabarin, his team down by one, makes the smart call and covers the puck. The Canucks get the face off down by one. Oh, and a chance for Vancouver now. And he shoots it. Theodore makes the save. His team's in a one-goal lead right now. He's covered. Feeds it out of the corner. Clark with the pass up the center. Then taken across the blue line by the Avalanche. Puck back to the point. Sabarin makes that poke check, protecting his goal. Brunette in the corner. Oh, baby, incredible save. It was tipped, but he made a beautiful save. Oh, and a chance for Vancouver now. From Clark over to Turgeon. And he brings it straight up. Covered. Fires it hard around the boards. Over to the right wing. Severin makes the stop. Down one goal, holding his part on the defensive bargain to stay in this one. Oh, and here's the odd man, three on two. Brunette hits the puck up to center. It goes to the point. Controlling it in the corner. Sabarin sends it to his defenseman. Now at center ice, it goes over to the right wing. Duterja from Brunette, shot. It goes to the defenseman. It's shot. They get off another shot. Sabarin with that pad save. Bulis sends it up to the center. The Canucks give their defenseman a break and switch the lines. The puck to the left wing. He sends it up the center over the blue line. Up the left side. He feeds it up the right side. Rycroft leading the attack two on two. And it was stopped off that left pad. Over to Mitchell. From Mitchell to Kessler. Hope check forced by Lyles. It's sent back to the point. Theodore stops it going low left side. Nothing doing there. And now Colorado into the zone. Saved by Sabarin. Mitchell hits the puck up to center. 
Skates along the boards. Locks it in. Controlling the puck at center ice. He stacks it. Got his pad in the way. Locks it in. Gets drilled behind the net. He gets checked hard. And that's going to be the dodge hit of the game, I'll bet you. In the neutral zone. Loxinen controlling the puck in the corner. Sabarin saves the powerful one-timer with a glove save. And he's got it through the zone. Passes it to the right wing. Nasland hit hard behind the net by Vanen. Over to the point. He's in the corner. Sabarin stopped it with his pads. Loxinen in the corner from Loxinen. He passes it up the right side. Sedin controls the puck in the neutral zone. There they go, the abs on the move. The puck bounces off the blocker and deflects away. Puck over to the right wing. It's passed to the point. Sello fires it out under pressure, but no one's there to get it. To Arneson. The Avalanche changing shifts. Fresh skaters coming out now. From Olin over to Nasland. Down in the corner. The puck goes to the defenseman. The Canucks have been looking up at their opponents all night long. You never want to have to come from behind if you can help it, but that's what they'll have to do tonight as they've trailed basically the entire game. Hit me now, Harry, with some knowledge. So far, this has not been a heavy-handed performance from either team. It really seems like they're trying to figure out the game plan as the game moves along. I know that we're going to see someone step up and make a big play, maybe defensively or in the net. That will inspire an offensive surge to break it open. But we'll just have to enjoy this game and see what happens. He passes it to the left wing. Taken into the zone by Colorado. Brisebois holds the puck in the corner. Sabarin stops it. He was thinking it was coming low, and he had to be ready with the stick. Oh, and there they go. The Canucks on the move. The goal stick to the rescue. Knocks that away. The puck is hit up the boards on the left side. Theodore is being showered with praise from the fans here in the home building. And you know what? He deserves it. Without him, they're out of this thing. Absolutely true. Some beautiful saves here tonight to keep this game close. And the puck is just about to drop. And Vancouver wins the draw. The puck played up center. Control. Theodore makes the stop. His team leading by just the one goal. He's got the puck at the point. The centering pass is made. Theodore with a terrific skate save. He brings the puck past the blue line. Hey Duke with the pass up the center from Mitchell. He passes it to the left wing. He's got it in the corner. That might not have been the hardest hit in the game, but it was perfect. It just stopped him right in his tracks. And they're controlling the puck in the defensive zone. Kessler. The shot. You have to have quick pads to play in the National Hockey League. And off that wrist shot, it was a pretty good left pad save. And the Canucks across that line again. Skrastinch makes a terrific defensive play. Hey Duke, center ice. Salo disrupts the play again. Good poke check. Oh, and here come the Canucks. And he has it at center ice. Sent back to the point. Oh, and Theodore stops it. A great glove stop. Leopold clears it out. Sabarin coming in off the bench. They give their forwards a rest with a shift change. Theodore camps out of the left side of the goal. The Avalanche control the faceoff. They are up by one in front of their home crowd. And now Colorado into the zone. Sabarin with a save. His team looking to get this one tied. Sabarin safely covers up. Doesn't want to let his team get behind any further. 
And the Avalanche win it, has it at the point. It's sent up the left side. Brunette holding that puck in the corner. Fitzpatrick picks up the loose puck in his own zone. He brings it past the blue line. Saved with the glove. He gets Pochek. Vancouver regains possession along the boards with the puck. The puck goes into the corner. Over to Sedin from Krychek. Terzhar uses his stick. Almost a hook, at least it looked like it. Here come the Avs with a chance. The puck comes out of the corner. The Perrier fires out the pass, but that's up for grabs. Gets it over to the left wing. Shot! The shot's blocked. Lyles plays it up to the center. Shoots! Severin stops it. He was ready with a the stick. There it is, Vancouver on the rush. To the point. Turgeon passes to the defenseman. It goes over to the right side. Here's an opportunity. Gets it over to the left wing. Severin with a fantastic glove save to stop that one-timer. The puck now goes to center ice. And out it goes. Hulk checked. Sedin along the boards. Lyles sends the puck up center ice. Then taken across the blue line by the Avalanche. He decides to center the puck. Saves it with a stick. To the right wing. Blocked. Vanninen did a terrific job at getting in the way of that hard shot. To La Perriere. Here come the Avs. Severin stops that shot. Heading for the low right side. The puck gets set up the right side. The Canucks wanted to make a line change with their forwards. They get a chance to do it now. The Perrier takes that puck through the zone. Cook comes in as his team chain ships. From Olin over to Bulis. Shoots. Good block there. Here's the rush two on two. The neutral zone. He's got it along the boards. Severin stops the one-timer with a stick. It's controlled by Arneson. He passes to the defenseman. From Salo to Bulis. Over the blue line. And it's deflected off the right pad. Over to the left wing. Mikesa from Sabarin. Now the puck up center ice. Oh, and a chance for Vancouver now. With a glove save, he deflected that shot. The Canucks switch up their offensive line. Here they come, and it's three on two. Loxanen takes it behind the net. Brisebois hits the puck out center. That shot was stopped by the pad. Severin decides to hold on, not wanting to take any chances. Down by one goal. Colorado picks it up. Sabarin makes the pass to the defenseman. Over to the right wing. Svatos gets contact in the neutral zone. Krychek roughing it up in the corner. Puck back to the point. And Vancouver breakaway chance. And now Vancouver with it across the line. Fired! Lyles over to Svatos. Over to Sakic from Svatos. It's shot. The Krychek passes over to the left wing. Cook, center ice. He plays it up to the center. They break up that shot attempt. Here it is, Colorado on the move. Svatos is against the boards. Over in the corner. Sabarin, smart play to just hold on. This face-off is to the left of the goalie. The Canucks win possession of the puck, trailing by one. He's got it over the blue line. From Wolski, over to McCormick. Here's the break, and they push it up there. And along the board, 
Woods with the puck, pokes it away. And the Canucks across that line again. It goes to the defenseman. He feeds the puck to the left wing. Clark dishes the puck center ice. Back to the point. Behind the net. Over to Mitchell. From Mitchell to Schwinar. The Canucks switch up defensive lines. Wolski from Brisebois. Oh, what a chance for Colorado now. Oh, and the puck hits a post. Olin over to Morrison. And here come the Canucks. Over to Bulis from Morrison to Olin. It's cut off. Through the zone. The puck gets set up the right side. From Olin over to Bulis. Carried it into the corner. It's into the corner. And the puck is controlled by Pyatt. Just a minute 57 now. Oh, and Sal controls the puck out at the point. This is a classic takeout, Bob. He nailed him in the corner by lining him up and following through with the shoulder. Well done. Stasny brings the puck up through the zone under two minutes now in the period. Sabarin makes the poke check protecting the goal. Oland passes it up the center. Pyatt carries the puck into the corner. Over to Morrison. Theodore passes to the defenseman. He's got it in the slot. A minute 21 on the clock. The puck is hit up the right side. McCormick controls the puck in the neutral zone. And now his team changing shifts for their forwards. From Pyatt to Salo. Hayduth roughing it up at center ice. Theodore with a beautiful poke check. Lyles dishes the puck center ice. Svatos brings it over the blue line. Less than a minute to go in the period. Hayduke feeds it out of the corner. Sabarin stops the shot, keeping the deficit at one. It goes to the point, controlling it in the corner. There are 43 seconds left. Sabarin safely covers up, doesn't want to let his team get behind any further. This guy can really pull the trigger. He is just a scorer. Super to have on your side. And you know the reason you got to have him? When the game's on the line, you want to know you've got a chance to win it. And this guy gives you that chance. 38 left to go. To the left wing. Skrastinch out at the point. It is in the net. That goal should see you there for the winning moments on the third period. With so little time left on the clock. And it goes off the goaltender and ends up in the net for a goal. I know this happens from time to time, Harry, but that fact certainly can't help the goalie now. Definitely not. Bob, in fact, looking at this replay, you can actually see the look of horror when he realizes that the puck hit him and still went in. There's a little period of time between that little tap of the puck and the signal for a goal. And that period of time feels like forever to the goalie. And I'm sure it's accompanied by a sinking feeling in the pit of your stomach as well. And we're going to start up action again. And the faceoff is won by Vancouver. You know, in hockey on offense, the idea is to acquire time and space. The best way to do that is to be a good puck handler like this guy. We'll get back to the action now as the official gets set to drop the puck. The faceoff won by the end. And now Colorado with it across the blue line. He stops him, shuts him down on that breakaway. Sabarin makes the smart move and covers up the puck. This is a breakaway save and it's a thing of beauty. We're gonna roll a tape back, Bob, and look how he gets this with a stick. Great balance and body position, Harry, to be able to get that stick on the puck. Rycroft with the puck. Mitchell over to Sedin. Just 14 seconds left. Back to the point. Locks in. Up ice. It's a three on two. It's shot. And now the Canucks get it back. He feeds it up the left side. He shoots it again. The buzzer sound signifying the end of the game with the score six to four. The Dodge Knight 
Astros stars of the game. Tonight's third star of the game. Number 19. Recap the night of hockey. It's time for the Dodge Highlight Reel and the post game report. And that's going to do it. NHL action on the 2K Sports Network. Along with Harry Neal, I'm Bob Cole. For all of our crew, we thank you for being with us. Lots more action to come right here on the 2K Sports Network. Good night, everyone. <laughs>